People who listened to this person's advice in the last bull run made an absolute killing. But for some reason, people are not paying attention as much anymore. And I think that might be to their detriment. So today we are going to be breaking down Alex Becker's top picks again and going through what he thinks about the market and the coins that he has picked. Now, I've made this video a couple of times. We're kind of tracking what he's doing in the market this time because he did do very well. And I got a lot of hate in my videos before about him saying how he's just dunking on the market and all of that. And guys... I have to express an opinion here that some of you may not like, but this is the truth. Crypto is, as Alex Becker says, player v's player. Everyone out here is actually here to make money. They're not here to make friends. They're not here for the utility. I'm sorry, they're just not. And they're not here to hold your bags. What everyone's here for is to buy early and sell on the people that come late. So yes, Alex Becker will be selling the bags that we're speaking about today. Maybe he already has, but there is proof in the data that I'm about to show you that it's not actually all bad. And it's my opinion that there there is a lot of information we can learn from him and that might not be just blindly following his investments because I actually built my own gaming portfolio which has done significantly better than his which I will be telling you the exact coins that are in there but it's learning from his style and applying those lessons to our own portfolios meaning we can get in early and we can also get in before the crash happens. We want to be cautiously optimistic right now and then we want to actually get out a little bit too early. That's what makes us the most amount of money because if you wait until the very top, the chances of you getting out on time are basically nothing, all right? I shit you not, it's basically zero because what will happen is we will reach a top. You'll believe that we'll get back to that top. The price will go down, you'll buy more. The price will go down, you'll buy more. The price will go down, you'll buy more and then we'll enter into a bear market and you would have lost your time to get out. So we're gonna discuss the coins that I'm in and when I'm gonna be getting out along with Alex Becker's portfolio. So here we have Alex Becker's picks. All right. These were his top picks, his most mentioned coins over the last few months. I built this portfolio with you guys. Now, this portfolio, no matter how much hate Alex Becker gets, I have not sold anything out of this portfolio and it is up 33% since we made it. No matter how much you hate you have for the guy, the portfolio is up 33%. That speaks for itself. Even if he has been nuking his own bags, it doesn't matter because the portfolio is up. So I don't really know what to tell you here, but this is a good idea. Gaming crypto will onboard a ton of new users. You can also trade the market when Alex Becker talks about things. It's very easy. Just watch his videos. You find something he mentioned. You get in early. We did exactly that with Inspect. We actually jumped in. We heard him, we hunted on his Twitter account, we heard him talking about it, or we read him talking about it, and then I assumed he would mention it in his video, so I actually bought some. I'm an early investor into Inspect, but I also bought more on the open market because I, in, in <laughs> I inspected him to, <laughs> to mention it in his video, which he did, and I think we made a clean 25-30% profit after he mentioned it. So that was awesome, and I sold it, because why not? I made a little bit of profit. But we can see here, Beam, which he's been talking about for a long time, up 155%. Superverse, 150%. Pretty sure that's him and Elio Trade's uh, company themselves. We got IMX up 92%. We got Inspect up 40%. And guys, I told you about Inspect. I've been holding Inspect. We got Paid Network up 32%. We got Nata Nakamoto Games, 22%. We got Ultura, 19%. Alluvium, 9.9%. And Cedify, 11%. I'm very much an advocate of CDFI. I think they're a great launch pad and you know that I'm very bullish on launch pads. Now, the ones that have done not so great, we got Sidus, we got BCB, we got D-Race and we got Wagami Games. Now, Sidus, I actually hold in my portfolio and I think they'll do well. I think it's just a matter of time before we see a real push in the gaming market. Personally, I don't think we've seen the push in the gaming market that we're going to see because we have been overshadowed by AI and meme coins. Meme coins have been the ones that have been overshadowing everything. Meme coins have been crazy. Look, we're at 1.65%, Bitcoin up 8%, Ethereum is up 15%, guys. So if you've been watching my channel, you know the trade that I have on Ethereum, not to go on too much of a tangent, but I've been buying Ethereum heavy because I actually think it will outperform Bitcoin and it is now, so far. It might not continue, but it is, and I'm very excited about that because 
It's a very big position in my portfolio. If you guys do want to trade at all, I do have all of the exchanges that I personally use. They're going to be linked down there in my description and you can get up to $50,000 worth of deposit bonuses. Now, I'm currently trying to show you the website, but why would it let me show you the website? Like, why can I show you? There we go. So Bitcoin's at 67K and I created this portfolio to show you that you don't need to use a ton of leverage in order to make some nice gains, all right? So we have a couple of trades open. Most notably, we got our Doge trade with $17 margin. That's got $1,000 in profit. We have a Say trade here at $800 in profit with only $250 of margin. Sui here, $300 profit. We have XRP at a lovely $8.5 in profit. And then we got Bitcoin, $50 in profit. Now, this is a small position. Look at my Bitcoin margin here is $22. I got this at an average price of $61. If I had to put a little bit more margin into there, I would have made a massive bag. But this portfolio is here to show you the opportunity without risking losing all of your money when we have liquidation events like we had the other day, right? This huge liquidation event that we hit, right? It was like here, 14%. All right, so don't get liquidated on those. Don't become another statistic. And if you do want to trade, the links are down there in my description, along with my own trades that I post in my Patreon. So the link is also down there in the description uh, if you want to follow those links. Just before we jump further into this video, I want to introduce you guys to today's channel sponsor, and that is Taboo Token. Now, you might remember these guys from the last bull run, but what they are is an innovative platform merging adult entertainment with blockchain technology and D. DeFi, creating a secure, transparent, and decentralized environment for users to explore premium content. Now, Taboo offers a platform where users' privacy is paramount and they ensure anonymity while consuming content. There is also a supportive ecosystem for content creators to show their talent and receive fair compensation. And they are also bridging the worlds of Web 2 and Web 3 by making blockchain and cryptocurrency technologies accessible to a wider audience. We also see monetization challenges in this realm and Taboo are offering diverse revenue streams and tokenomics models for users and creators. They also have community engagement at heart with interactive features and exclusive live events to foster a sense of belonging among the community. If we take a look at the coin market cap chart, we can see that Taboo actually reached a previous all-time high for their market cap of 600 million. And once they had 45 million in USD daily trading volume. They also plan to surpass previous achievements with further growth and they will be updating their marketplace at the end of March featuring a renewed UI, UX, live streaming, tipping and fear on and off ramp solutions to help with mass adoption. They also recently have been listed on Bing X exchange and they say they have other top exchanges lined up for listings very soon. So Taboo is one of the leading solutions in the crypto adult entertainment space, offering privacy, innovation and a premium user experience while redefining the entertainment industry through blockchain technology. With that said, if Taboo token sounds interesting to you guys and you do want to check it out, I'll leave all the links down there in my description and let's jump back into this. Now, with that said, what we were talking about is Becker's portfolio. I think these are projects to look out for. I think paying attention to the big influencers in this space, far bigger than me, they got far more movement, far more sway in the market is a good idea. Also, the way he likes to trade and get in and get out of these markets, I think is very important. And also understanding the player vs player mentality, okay? Understanding that no one is your friend in crypto. They're not your friends, all right? I will be selling crypto when the market gets too euphoric. In fact, I've already sold my Bitcoin miners, not all of them, but a big chunk of my Bitcoin miners, which I was buying in the bear market every single month. Boom, dollar cost average, dollar cost average. I made a massive bag on Bitcoin miners. And now instead of selling Bitcoin, I sold those miners because they're up a lot, right? Now I'm holding cash. I got money there. So now I'm comfortable with the market. We can have a nice pullback. I got the cash to deploy waiting for that. If it doesn't pull back, I'll deploy that cash into other opportunities. Then the market will get overly euphoric, which we can see over here. We are in extreme greed, although we can stay in extreme greed for a while. You can see here, if we go on max, here we spent from November 14th, really all the way to February 22nd. So a few months, three months in extreme uh, greed there, but we did have a big worry in the middle of that. So that's the kind of thing that can happen. But guys, I will be selling, your friends will be selling, everyone around you will be selling. So don't think that you're in some sort of club where no one's gonna sell. Nobody is here for the utility. 
I hate to break it to you. I thought that everyone was here for the utility in 2017. I'm here for the utility. I held everything until it went to zero. Well, it didn't go quite to zero, but less than what I put in. So this time I will not do the same thing as I did in 2017. And I proved my track record in 2021. If you've been following the channel since then, comment again on this video. I made it under there because I know you guys have made it. You're still watching the channel from back then. You've been through the bear market. Your bags were packed in the bear market. Now you're like me and you're sitting, you're looking at your portfolio every day and you're like, God damn, I've made it, right? So happy days for us. But with that said, let's look at the portfolio that I built, right? So this is the portfolio I built with you guys here on the channel. I am up 250% on this portfolio that we built together, okay? So we started this portfolio with, uh, what have we got? We started it with, I think it's like 1,000, yeah, $1,400. We're up $3,600 with a $5,000 total balance, guys. Our number one mover was probably one of the biggest trades I have ever done, and that was with TVK. We bought a chunk of this directly here. I told you guys about this trade. I told my Discord about this trade. Remember the links for that are down there in the description as well. But this is up 600%. 600% guys, that's a 6X. $1,000 into $6,000, $10,000 into $60,000. All right, guys, incredible, incredible moves. We also have Ronan here, which is the ecosystem behind Axie Infinity, building other games 500% 500% move. C Defy dot fund. Talking about these guys since the bear market. They are in 487% gain. Sidus, 300%. Champions of Arbathina. This was $2 uh, million when I brought it to you guys. And now 300% up. Still a $6 million market cap, meaning it's the smallest crypto, actually bar rainy here, that is on this list. Although I didn't buy these bottom three. They were what I was looking at, but I never actually bought them here on the channel. Maybe it could be a good time to start adding them. What's that? Oh, rainy is down 56% on the week. Maybe it's a good time. Let me buy a little bit of that, actually. Let's buy. I'll add this to my portfolio later on. Let's buy 100 bucks. Let's buy $100 of that just so we can track it. I'll then add this in my portfolio later for the keyboard warriors who tell me that you can't buy it directly through uh, CoinGecko. Yeah, I, I'm aware. Thank you, though. So we added that here at $100. We'll see how that goes. All right, guys. So that's the portfolio that I'm looking at for the gaming space. These are all cryptos that I think can do very well still going forward. TVK is actually a gaming and entire cryptocurrency ecosystem. They're building stuff. Ronan is building stuff. CDFI will give you access to some of the best opportunities in the crypto gaming space. Sidus is also launching a launch pad themselves. And there is a lot of opportunity here that you guys can go out and research yourself. Of course, I don't know what's going to happen with these coins. I have no idea what will happen. I hold them in my portfolio. I'm willing to take the risk. If you guys want to risk your own money, you're free to do so. But if it goes to zero, that is on you not on me. Okay, guys, because I will also be losing my money as long as I haven't already taken profits. Okay. And when I'm taking profits will be when the market is euphoric or when I decide. So with that said, I have enjoyed this video. If you enjoy this video, smash up that subscribe button and do comment in the comment section again. I made it if you have been with me until the end of this video. Hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.